Hot Girl Summer is here, and yes, I am talking about the sweat. The most common question I get asked currently is, how to embrace our curls in the summer? From the salt, to the chlorine, to the sand, to the popsicle in your hair. Summer is no joke on any hair type, let alone those of you who have waves and curls. Biggest of thank yous to JVN Hair for sponsoring today's video. I'm such a fan of Jonathan Van Ness. I actually met him at BeautyCon a couple years ago, and I'm just such a fan of him as a human being, so thank you, Jay. We're on a nickname basis. All the products will be linked in the description box down below, and if you check out jvn.com, once again, link down below, uh, there is a little hair quiz to figure out which of these products would be best for you, and if you take the quiz, you receive 20% off of JVN hair products. So definitely don't miss that opportunity. Let's dive in. When I picture summer, I picture myself laying out by the pool, getting a nice tan. I don't think, however, about the chlorine or my hair turning green. So, right off the bat, how do we prep our hair for heading out to the beach or pool these summer days? If you only get one thing from this video, listen up. Hydrate, hydrate, hydrate. Believe it or not, water is more damaging than the sun, and we often don't think of this when this comes to our hair. Especially if your hair is highly porous. If your hair is highly porous, when you jump in that pool with some dry, brittle hair, it's just gonna soak up all that chlorine like a sponge, soak up all the chemicals, and your hair will become a sponge of chlorine. So, what I personally recommend, whether you're getting into the ocean or a pool, is properly hydrating your hair before you get into the water. You can do this by adding some hair oil and sealing up that hair cuticle so that all that moisture stays within. If you haven't used a styler for the day, I do recommend using some sort of an air dry cream, a leave-in conditioner, some sort of moisturizing emollient property to really restore that moisture and ensure that that cuticle is locked in place. The key is to prevent damage instead of repair it. So what I would like to do personally is use a protective style at the pool. I see a lot of girls wear like cute little scarves, like a little silk scarf, um, like over a ponytail. I personally always like to do braids. I do a double braid situation to ensure that my hair does not tangle and then end up leaving me, you know, losing a lot of hair in the detangling process at the end of the day. So when you catch me at the beach or the pool this summer, I will most likely have an oil in my hair to seal in that hair cuticle and have a cute protective hairstyle like braids. Now you've left the pool or beach and probably have salt, sand, and a little bit of blue popsicle juice in your hair. What flavor was the blue popsicle? Like blue raspberry? I do feel like that was always the best flavor that you fought over. Like no one was fighting over grape. You know what I'm saying? No one was like, ooh, 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 give me the purple one. No, no that was never. That was never happening. Stop, drop, and roll. Before getting into the shower, I recommend a pre-wash scalp oil. You simply wanna take a sufficient amount on your hands and really massage it in. Take your time, work it into your roots. You can work it all the way down to your hair ends. I find that if I put a ton of oil in like the mid hair shaft area, I get a very weighed down look. So I like to focus it on the roots, really massaging it in, and then focusing in on those ends as well. JVN's pre-wash scalp oil is Probably my new absolute favorite. It's so stinking good. All of JVN products are sulfate, silicone, and cruelty-free and vegan. And all their product packaging are sustainably made. This one in particular is made with glass, so it is recyclable, which really means a lot to me. This nutrient-dense golden oil really works to strengthen and repair your hair strands. It also clarifies, cleanses, and calms the scalp. And a key ingredient in this product is basil root extract, which is known for helping to combat um, hair loss in general. Scalp oils in general are fantastic year round, but I do find that I have to shampoo and cleanse my hair so much more in the summer to get rid of that buildup of calcium and salt from the ocean. So I find that it's a game changer when you are having to shampoo a lot. From the JVN line, I've been using the volumizing shampoo alongside the nurture hydrating conditioner. I find that I like the volume that the volumizing shampoo gives me, but then in the summer, I need that extra moisture to combat all the salt and sand in my hair. All JVN formulas feature patented sugar Sugarcane derived hemisqualane, clinically proven sustainable, and it's essentially superior to silicone. Hemisqualane safely works to protect hair from color fade, reduces damage, prevents breakage, and strengthens hair without the product buildup that you would typically get with silicone. I really appreciate this being a sugarcane derived squalane. Traditionally, squalane is unfortunately found in shark livers and we must save the sharks. So I love that this is a vegan and cruelty free sugarcane derived squalane. 
And I did quickly want to touch on combating that green color that chlorine often gives you. I grew up swimming. I was on summer swim team. I was my neighborhood assistant coach, never the head coach, but the assistant coach. <laughs> and um, I would definitely suffer from green hair in the summer for sure. When it comes to counteracting any color, you want to simply pop on over to your color wheel in your mind. We all have color wheels in our mind, right? So <laughs> on the color wheel, uh, my hair turns like a yellowish green. So when I get in chlorine a lot, so then I counteract that with purple. Purple shampoo and conditioner, ladies and gentlemen. Not Your Mother's has some of my all time favorite purple shampoo and conditioner line. It's so good. I think it's called All About the Brass. Maybe I just made that up, but it's really, really good and I use it like all summer long. And I love how affordable it is. I highly recommend it. It's definitely very pigmented and does the job. When it comes to styling, we want to layer, baby. So we've already done our scalp oil, we've already shampooed, and we've conditioned. We're fresh out of the shower now. Totally switch it up depending on whatever your hair likes, right? Some people like a foam, some people like a cream, like myself. Uh, some people only like gels. I, I really try, especially in the summer, to layer. I find that this gives me the most complete 360 protection from humidity, which causes frizz. So whether that's foam, mousse, cream, whatever it is for you, you know me, girl, I used a cream. So I jumped in with the JVN Air Dry Cream, and it is positively fire. And by the way, this packaging, it's made from a recyclable aluminum tube and a post-consumer recyclable cap. As mentioned, all products feature the hemisqualane. This specific product's key ingredients are chia seed extract and moringa seed oil. Moringa seed oil is key for luster and shine, and chia seed extract almost adds like a little bit of a touchable hold. I would consider it like a very, very, very light gel almost built into this day cream. I did choose to go ahead and jump in with the Maui Moisture Gel. You guys know I love this gel. It's been my favorite gel for about a year now. It works, I can trust it and count on it. In the summer, I do especially need that extra hold if I wanna get to third, fourth, fifth day hair. But if you don't like a strong hold or you're new to having hold in your hair, I think this product would actually do a beautiful job all on its own. Moving on to the JVN Complete Nourishing Shine Drops. These are fire. They are, of course, silicone free, once again made with that Hemi Squalane. It's a really light, weightless formula, I find. It's lighter than most oils, um, so I do find that I use a little bit more than I would with a traditional oil, but I can also get away with using more, if that makes sense, because sometimes when I use oils, like I'll just end up looking like a greasy mess, whereas with these shine drops, I feel like I can go a little bit more heavy handed and my hair doesn't end up looking weighed down or greasy or anything like that. So if that is something you struggle with, I highly recommend these. To conclude what we learned here today, number one, protective hairstyles and products for when you're at the beach with your friends and family this summer. A pre-wash scalp oil. Don't forget the pre-wash scalp oil. Frequent cleansing and removing of that buildup of sand, salt, chlorine, and popsicle juice. Whip out the color wheel this summer and layer your products up. Biggest of thank yous again to JVN for sponsoring today's video. I'm so appreciative, such a fan, Jay. <laughs> um, yeah, I just hope this video was fun. I feel like I've gotten a lot of requests to do like a summer hair care vibe and, um, and I had so much fun creating this beachy mermaid look for you guys today with all the JVN products. If you are interested in checking them out, be sure once again to check out the links in the description box down below and also take the quiz to get 20% off of JVN products. I don't know how often that happens. So definitely take advantage. These products are really, really good. I think that's everything. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thank you so much for watching. And until next time, I'll see you soon. Bye, y'all.